Now, this is a brief recording um, video to show you how to add a um, something to MailChimp and send out an email to our group. So first you log into MailChimp.com and then you hit the login button on MailChimp. And the login will be our email address and the password. So now you're into the MailChimp. At this point, you go to Campaigns. And these are previous campaigns that we've sent out. You can see how many people opened them um, and how many subscribers they went out to, etc. And you can also create a campaign and that's what we're going to do today. And this is a regular campaign. And we're going to send it to our entire list. So at this point you go down to next and click next. Now you name the campaign, put the actual subject line of the email, and say who it's from. That's all important to do properly. You also want to check lies the personalized to field. You check that so that it will be sent to someone's name, and it'll, this will go to the first name if, they, if we have a first name on file for them. So in this case, we go back to Mike's original email to me, and this is his original email where he it laid out what he wanted to do on this meeting. And so we're going to talk about a little bit, let's see, John Street Cafe. TriMet will be the special presenter at this meeting. So I'm going to say just the campaign name will be um, September. September 2016 Boosters meeting. But the email subject will something better, be something better that more interesting. Um, how about Boosters AM, Boosters Breakfast. To feature. Testing. That probably could be improved, and that probably doesn't have to be a capital. Okay. And we're from name, we're going to say Mike Johnson. And then you go up to the little stiff line above the return and hit that and put another space. It always is best, people open stuff more likely if it has uh, somebody's name from it. And uh, that is about all we need to do there. Um, we get auto post to Facebook after sending. And I have it here, St. John's Boosters Business Association fan play page. I have a number of pages I'm responsible for. So that's why that's in there. Okay. Um, Wednesday breakfast. I'm going to say that. Featuring time. Featuring TriMet. And stop changes. There. Boosters Wednesday breakfast meeting featuring TriMet and stop changes. I think that will be more interesting and more likely for people to click on than a briefer um, than a briefer uh, subject line. Okay, so we have that. We're going to go to next. Okay, 
Now you want to do your templates. We have a saved template. Go to Save Templates. And this is it right here. And we're going to select it. Okay, we have the template selected. All set. Now, what we want to do is make sure this template meets with uh, what Mike wants to say. So we have this August, we're going to change this here. Let's go to this little sign up here. When you scroll over it, this edit block comes up and edit. And we're going to say this September. And it'll be Wednesday. September 21 at 7.15 a.m. John Street Cafe, North Lombard. And let's go back to see what Mike had us right here. Okay. Boosters, I hope this finds everyone well and rested. Okay. Command C. And those, that's just the agenda. Let's minimize that. Okay. So, this month we're going to, and that doesn't responsible. We're not doing that anymore. And B. So, boosters, I hope this note finds everyone well and well rested after a great summer. We have a lot of things that work, so I'm very excited for this coming Wednesday. I'm going to change that to tomorrow. Tomorrow. Um, we already put it tomorrow. We're gonna, we will be meeting at the John Street Cafe. I'm just going to say tomorrow. Our guest speaker will be Michelle Weifels from TriMet. She will be presenting the changes to the bus stops in St. John's. I can eliminate a couple of spaces. We will also be discussing the Halloween walk, the tree lights, and the future of the marquees. I look forward to seeing you. Now, I don't think I need to change much in this agenda. It's already in there, but let me double check and see if he made any major changes in it. So we have, let's see, we have the call to order, roll call, introduction, treasure, membership, reports, unfinished business, Michelle Weifels, 8 o'clock, guest speaker and Michelle Weifels. May 15, new businesses. Oh, we have SJNA elections. Ugh. Okay. Let's see if I can go back to that. So we still have call to order, roll call introductions, minutes from last meeting, staff reports. That's all the same. Unfinished business. Here's where we're going to change this here. Guest speaker. You can make that. New business. New business. Let's see if that changed. I think it may have. Let's see. SJNA elections. Halloween walk. Boosters elections. Let's see. I just copy and paste, but I want to make sure it makes sense and I do it correctly. Okay. Okay, that laid way too many things in here. So, new business. I'm going to go here. Tab. Let's eliminate that. October. Halloween walk. Get rid of that. Sometimes just copying and pasting isn't really what you want to do, so you got to watch that. Like 
activity. And then community. There we go. That looks much better. Agenda, blah, 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 unfinished business, guest speaker. Okay, we're going to live with this. I look forward to seeing you at the meetings. And then we have this link already in there. Learn how easy it is to join. So this all looks good to me. Uh, we have the when and the where and who the guest speaker is, blah, blah, blah. Okay, we're going to save and close. And as you can see, the actual template has changed. The next time you come in here to do a new template, it'll be this new information will be on it. Okay? Now we go next. And you're about ready to get rock and roll on this. Everything is checked. And don't worry about social cards. We've got monkey rewards. Okay, let's hit send. There's a monkey thing we're going to send now. Whing! And then the nice thing is you get to play high five with the monkey. So that's always fun. Okay, guys. Bye-bye.